Hello subscribers, welcome to a live stream of AD&D's Pools of Darkness. We are doing an Iron Man run of this with five paladins and one magic user. All right, copy protection. Journal, page nine, after combat nine. Battlefield. Okay, where are we at? Ah, yes. Okay. So we are in the town with all the ogres and ettins and giants. But we're not invisible. Let me double check, see how long and large lasts. I think it lasts quite a while. Yeah, it's one turn per level. Yeah, that lasts for quite a while. Outside of combat, it's like several hours. Okay. Large moment. Slater and Grunk. And Fire Touch does not last long, so we're not going to cast that until you know we need it. Dragons rear up in defense. The antechamber shakes to their roars. Hey, Duncan. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing this morning? Two dragons. Okay. We can handle that. That I hit D and it skipped my guy's turn. That's okay, we still got it. <laughs> Paladin's not immune to fear, I know. They are not. The air crackles with smell of magic as the hill giant. Shaman completes a spell. Shaman laughs, confident as victory. Now you will pay for your folly. <laughs> You've come to the end of your lives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've heard that before, haven't we? Okay. You have a necklace of missiles for using that. To prevent some spell casting here. You kill this magi. Come up here. Fireball. So we've heard fool, folly, and blunder. Although the fool was in 
Seeker of Silver Blades. This game, they've said we've blundered into a room, and <laughs> this time it said we've follied. No, I don't think so. Looks like another fireball. Right there, it looks perfect. Take him out with your dagger. 5200 experience. Ah, we're doing a level up on a few. Nice. So we're not ready to go there yet. Let's go get our level up. Hey, Jimmy, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Are you going to name your wizardry failures folly and blunder when you get a chance? No, the game is falsely accusing me of blunders. So far everything I've done has been planned that they're calling blunders. <laughs> and we've had success too. So the game's just completely confused. Okay. Now, I am curious to see if I'm going to get a Thaco boost again. Because it was weird. Last time it, it boosted it by two, but then the next level it did nothing. So, Thaco of minus four. Ah! Thaco's not going down anymore. Dang. It might on the magic user. Meteor Swarm. No, it's still 9 on the magic user. Dang. They could stay in the same. At least we get another 4th level spell. Let's see. We have Cure Sirius. I could neutralize Poison here. Yeah, let's get neutralized poison. And we get another eighth level spell. Okay, we can make someone dance. Everybody else have their spells? No, you're do level threes. Spell prayer. Jimmy says the game is lying and cheating and now it stole our Thaco. Yes, exactly. I guess maybe once you get to a certain level, Thaco doesn't go down anymore. I don't know. <clears throat> okay, we're ready to go to the next area. We need the Bard's Tail phase door so we can just go right through the wall. Instead of having to slog all the way through the halls. Leads to a cave. Yes, we enter. Okay, here we go. Ah, uh, yes, I remember this. There's a, uh, I think it's a fire giant in here. And the whole time she'll say, oh, you guys are lame. You're not going to be able to reach me. Go back now. 
that kind of thing. You are dizzied. You know what? Let me check this first. I don't think last time I went west. Let's see what's in here. Definitely nothing. Jimmy says Duncan would know, I'm guessing. Oh. That was an illusionary wall. Okay. Weird. So yep, yeah, there was nothing there. Fire giant wearing the robes of a mage and her guards appear before you. She folds her arms on her chest and speaks to you. Throws a leather bag at your feet for killing the hill giant shaman. But you do well to leave. Many have tried to penetrate my cave and their bones now adorn my walls. A ring. Ooh, nice. Let's see, Grunt does not have a ring. Let's see what kind of ring it is. Let's equip and see if it protects us from something. Ah, oh, it's a cursed. Lame. Just for that, we're killing her for sure. You see a crushed skull on the floor, it looks familiar. Stop and collect your thoughts, yes. A rain lodged in skull. Pick it up, yes. Put it on, examine it, throw it away. Throw it away. Okay. We were bamboozled. Duncan says, I'm not going to look it up. I cheat anyway, so I always hit. <laughs> I do not remember that it is cursed. Because I never really put it on, and it's easy to get rid of curses, we just have to go to a temple. I don't even know what it does, like if it being cursed actually hurts me in any way. I didn't know my armor class changed. Still minus 11. I'm not sure it does anything unless you're wearing uh, non-magical armor. Let's see if we still hit. We're still hitting. So yeah, I don't know if it did anything or not. Fire giants block your way. The mage sends her greetings. Not many pass the wards. <laughs> they attack. Not many, huh? All it takes is one. Uh, Cone of cold. Do wonders here. Right there. Boom. 
I could see her next saying, not many cast Cone of Cold. Surrenders. Nope, we're going to kill you before you surrender. Take no prisoners. Okay, I think I can rest in this room here. Fumble with something. Demand to see the object. It's a long iron bar, but will not say what it is for. Do you tell him, tell them your plan to kill the fire giant mage? Yes. They ask you to follow them. Yeah, I'm not doing that. I remember this. So either this room we can rest in. No, it must be the room over there then, one farther over. I think it's... Oh, Medusa sneak up on us, okay. It's a lot of Medusa. It's just one group though. It's this room, maybe. Yeah, here we go. <clears throat> All right, let's start our enlarge. Uh, do that again. Element. Oh, you know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Cast the magic missile. Get another enlarge. I'm going to give the mage an enlarge, too. Slater. Grunk. E forte. Okay, so since that lasts so long, and this is five hours, we're going to do this, and we should still be enlarged. Oh, we got scammed. It says it was one turn per level. Outside of combat, when you walk, it's one minute. And I think it's 60 minutes outside of combat per turn. But maybe when you rest, it doesn't do it that way. Because in combat, I think 10 minutes is a turn. Okay. Dead end. Nope, we're not going west yet. I hear golems. Jimmy says so much for these Medusa's sneaking ability. Yeah. They usually are pretty sneaky, but those weren't. thousand experience faint is a forcing light fills the air find yourself in a different corridor Here we go again we'll 
with the spinner. So this is the room we went in right here. There's not gonna be anything south, is there? Oh, there are, okay. Spiders drop silently from a recess in the ceiling. Poison drips from their fangs. Ah. At least we have neutralized poison now. Actually, move move you over here. As they appeared from behind. We don't want the mage getting hit. Phase spiders, kill those first. They have a very strong poison. No treasure. Can't rest, I'm sure. Okay. Salamanders. We haven't seen those since Curse of the Azure Bonds. I thought they were supposed to have an aura that did damage. Fire damage. Assassins are busy dressing their knives with poison. They see you and attack. FK Assassin. <laughs> It's fire knives, but the FK sounds funny. It says a robe. Instead of a cloak. Robes aren't magical. Ah, oh, we can rest here. Wait a minute, it just said an item was uncursed. How did how did that happen? Did this spell magic get automatically cast? It did. What? Hold on. Did I have remove curse on the mage? Okay, I do have remove curse, but I don't have it memorized. So the fix command somehow must have automatically memorized this. Because I don't have it on the paladins either. I, mean, I have I have the spell, but I didn't have it memorized. Let me double check. That's weird. So I guess the fix command will automatically memorize spells that you don't have memorized. Yeah, it was the ring. It was that ring right there? Drop. 
I never knew that. Learn something new every time we play. Assassins are gathered around a table. One holds up a piece of paper and a leather bag. I vote we take it. Attack. You got hit? Really? Lame. damage surrenders thousand experience what the this has to be like super super good magical equipment that's worth a ton took one of each of those we'll see what it is it's probably like leather armor plus four or something Let's do our enlarges. Last so long. Twenty two strength. Moving over here. Jimmy says fire knives have one known weakness, explosions. <laughs> Jai Mage steps from the shadows. I see neither wards nor gold will deter you. You are even more ambitious than I thought. But death will now will be your only reward now. <laughs> or you can stop where the mage escapes. Imagine that. Piece of cake.
turn it on here. stares blankly. Duncan stares blankly. That's okay. Which way do I want to go? North, maybe? Dust coats, okay. Cool. Get another room to rest in. More on larges. Noise behind the north door. Fire giants fall away from the door, surprised by your boldness. <laughs> Fire elementals. Shaman. Okay, we'll get the shaman first. All right, cone of cold time. We, let's see, where do we want to position? Oh, we're going to do massive damage here. Right here. delay. Hey, Slimy, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Monsters leave from the shadows. We're still enlarged. Delay.
Okay, another place to rest. the mages take a five oh that's insanely good she's 47 years old i'll have to get some her her some uh, elixirs of youth okay medusa I was going to cast a fireball, but my mage went so late. Sassa greet you. I would treat you at the mage's behalf. Will you hear me out? No. Not going to hear you out. You're just going to be killed. got to be getting close to the fight with the uh, woman. For such small creatures, you have a great deal of arrogance, but it will be the death of you. I keep hearing that. Little boy that cried wolf. Look at those paladin saving throws. Old person, we resisted five.
total of seven we've resisted now. Okay. Wand of Ice Storm. Hit that mage. has the fine longbow. Start snipering these down. Backstab for 45 damage. I don't know how to backstab me when there was no one on the front. That was a scam. Finally, the mage gets to cast. Twenty one thousand experience. Okay, it looks ooh, a fine longbow, nice. What's so good about those is they transfer to that uh, other world, the other dimensions. There's a ring and a cloak too. Okay. Low on item slots, I'll figure out what to get rid of. Grab one of these. I'm assuming restoration is on those. Other armor drop. Short sword. Let's check it out. So take a minus three. It's a plus three short sword drop. Javelins. Those will disappear once I throw them, so there's no point. Let me hang on. I picked up a the fine longbow, so I'm gonna drop the composite longbow plus two. Right on. Let's check it out. It's three. Plus three trident. Eh, it's not worth it. Losing a shield.
Minuted sword. That's a plus two to a minute sword. Drop. Okay. I think that's it. I guess I can pick up the javelin since I threw everything else away. I hear something shouting to the room to the west. Warn the dragons. Look what Mel Slime says. Paladins are cool, but elven rangers, clerics are cool too. Plus one long sword, and if you choose a god, you gain benefits. Yeah, the problem with that is the level caps are low. It makes them useless later on. The level cap screws you over. Okay, let's see here. Let's lay on hands. There's going to be dragons somewhere. Here, maybe. So let's do mirror image. Haste. Fire touch. Look about slime says in the GOG version you can ignore the level cap because of the tool. Yeah. I mean it's you could hex edit to do that too, but you're not playing by the original rules. It's cheating. The door on the north wall is just closing. Here we go. Dragons roar in defiance. Mighty fighters, ha! Killing giants is best easy sport. They attack. How many we got? Three? Okay. Fireball, I guess. Can I hit both of those? Right here, I'll hit both, I think. Yep. <laughs> Follow the dragons. Okay. Cool, so let's go back to town and get our level up. Level 19. Nice. Yeah, so far paladins are far, far better than rangers what I've seen. These saving throws are insanely good. So, what do you have? Neutralize. Okay, so let's get a cure serious. You have cure serious, so let's get a neutralize. Curious. So we'll have neutralized poison on all of them, which is awesome. In case we do end up getting poison, which is bound to happen eventually. Yeah, that's if you cheat, liquid metal slime. The level cap is not 40. 
Not in first edition AD&D. For elves, it's really low on the ranger. In the gold box games, like in this one. Okay, let's see. I guess... You know what? Let's go get some elixirs of youth. I think Zen will keep has those down here. Drow Guard, they want a 50 platinum tax. Okay, fine. So much money, it doesn't matter. I think it's over here if my memory serves me correct. Yeah. Let's get all this identified. Bloke of Protection plus three. Ring of Cold Resistance. Nice. Okay. Minus 14 armor class. I'll have to give this cloak a displacement to someone else. Let's see. Where's your cloak? You already have one. Javelin's plus four. He's wearing plate mail, so the cloak's not going to work. Another sling plus three. Don't need it. Where's your cloak? Oh, you're wearing bandit mail. Cloak won't work for him either. Dagger plus three. Sell. You have a cloak of displacement. Magic user, do you have one? No, you don't. Okay, perfect. You're getting it. There we go. Okay. An extra ring of protection plus two. What are you wearing? You have a plus three. Someone Slater of armor, so it won't work. You have a plus three. You have plus two, okay. Let's free up an item slot here. Okay, now, elixirs of youth. Anybody else have any slots? Oh, not enough money. Look at Metal Slime says, uh, Dragonlance scenario, elves are very powerful. No, fools games, they're useless after curse. Yeah, they can't be raised from the dead. That's the biggest problem with elves. Besides the level caps. But I do like elves. They can be resurrected with the resurrect spell, but temples don't have that usually. Okay, we have a few elixirs now. So, let's use them. 36, that shaved off three years. Magic user is the one that needs it the most. Forty-four. I shaved off four years. Thirty-nine. All right. I'm gonna buy some more. your age gets too high, you'll just drop dead in the middle of combat.
Some of these gems are only worth five platinum. Okay, Duncan went from 39 to 33. D Forte is 36. O is 33. Okay, this just a few more times. This is to offset all of our haste castings. Duncan's in his 20s now. Look at that, 27. One of those gems must have been really expensive. Spots overloaded. Duncan's twenty five. Let's get him a little bit younger. Twenty two. There we go. Next, we'll do element. Who's thirty one? Get rid of all these gems that we've been hauling around since Seeker of the Silver Blades. Bose 28, Forte is 29, Elements 35, okay. Slater. Thank goodness for hotkeys. Could you imagine doing this with a mouse? If they didn't have a where you could do multiples. Okay, 
Okay, Bo's 25. He's in good shape. Select. That's the B forte. Yeah, that gem was worth twenty five hundred there. Twenty seven, thirty, thirty three. Do you imagine if the fountain of youth was this easy? Maybe another one of those vials. Planet would soon become uh, overloaded with people, that's for sure. Elements in his 20s, he's good. Later's 29, he's good. So now we just have to work on Grunk. We'll buy him two at a time. Thirty-one. Wow, those were some potent ones. Oh, yeah, he has another one. Okay, boom. Okay, everybody's in their twenties. Now we can buy some real items. See, what do we got? Mage scrolls. Bring up protection from evil. The mage would be the only one to benefit from that. But I'm not going to unequip the ring of blinking or the ring of wizardry for that. So, nope. We'll buy some mage scrolls, though. That one, that one. Let's see what's on these. Charm Monsters Powered Blind Stone to Flesh. That one's mediocre. Flesh to Stone Feeble Mind Minor Globe. It's even worse. Spell, spell. Let's see what's on this one. Disintegrate Read Magic. Monster summoning. Monster summoning is good. We'll get one more of those. Now 
was enough right there. Okay. Oh, it's random. It's completely random. That's weird that they show the three scrolls then. Power word stun, protection from normal, read magic. That's terrible. It's not even worth lugging around. Try one more time. I want a cold stinking cloud death spell. Okay, we'll keep that one. Alright, finally, we're ready. So let's go back and kill some dragons. Woman sobbing, approach. What do you want? I've done nothing. What do you ask her about? Crying. They took my father to the black pits. She turns and bolts away. Dragon patrol swoops down and attacks. Looks like there's three of them. Eighteen. I'm gonna do a delay, I think. Separate like this. I don't think their breath attack can go that far. And they have a lot of movement. Wow, they can. They can breathe 18 distance, the, the blue dragons. Okay, I'll have to chase them then. hornet's nest what it only did one damage that's a scam that should have hit him a lot more than that yeah that dart of hornet's nest did not transfer properly it's like it transferred as a normal dart We'll throw it since we know it's useless. time it worked. So we cleaned out this area. We need to go into the dragon cave next. All right, so let's think about this. So we have resist cold, resist fire. Let's 
It's about the best we can do. bit confused as to why it won't allow us to go in here. I left... I left via the cave. That doesn't make any sense to me. It's acting like there's no entrance. monsters in there. Why don't you have anything equipped? Oh, because he threw that dart. That's right. What is it? Gollum's Well, Slime says it'd be cool if you could charm monsters, these iron golems. Yeah, that would be cool. Like Bard's Tail style. 
Alright. Let's hope our mage goes quickly here again. There we go. Hard still where you can have monsters permanently join you. So this is the way we went before. The tunnel is sealed. And now we got scammed with a random encounter. Is it going to tell us? It's not telling us about the entrance. Uh, here we go. It's over here. Okay. Yes. Warned of your coming. Dragons rush to defend the Eyrie. How many? It's a lot. Okay. Eighteen. Let's move you over here. It cast Charm Person, the White Dragon. That's funny. Thank goodness it didn't work. Alright. Uh, I mean, I have Dispel Magic. I could just Dispel it. Fine Longbow, where are you? There you are. Ooh. 64 damage. Mage barely survived that. Okay, he can't get out of the way, so... Magic Missile. There we go. As then a battle settles from the air, you notice a man in dark robes watching you from the end of the corridor. He ducks out of sight to the east. Okay. Some enlarges. We'll do fire touch too as we get closer to the this doorway here.
paste. Your image. Mine blank. Globe. Sometimes there's a fight in here, sometimes there isn't. There it is. I, Mode Tirith, patriarch from the cult of the dragon, declare this challenge. Let's watch. Dragons circle each other briefly, then close with fierce speed. The blue dragon crumples to the ground. Oh, we didn't have to do a fight. Okay. I know there's a place where we can rest. I think it's here. Yeah. Still fire touch, still hastened. For how long? Found a sword, short sword. All right, they go minus six. Check it out. Minus five, so it's a plus four short sword. Eh. Find a cash shield. Minus eleven. It's ten. It's a plus three shield. No, it's a plus two shield. Drop. I'm pretty sure over here there's something we have to get. Still enlarged, but everything else wore off. I don't like that. Hey, Cody. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Party looks new. Did I miss a holiday party wipe? No, it's the same party. This is a Paladin party that um, I transferred all the way from Curse of the Azure Bonds. Still alive and well. Gosh, I wish I knew what I'm fighting in here. We're dragons. See how many there are. You're doing well? Good here, Cody. Four of them. Okay. Range of 22? This one's 20, 12, so we can reach that one. Yeah, I saw you were playing uh, Minecraft with your friends last night, Cody. I stopped in and said hi, but um, I don't think you saw it. Let's see. Here. survived 
Oh, wow, okay. We'll take this back to town and get it all identified. <laughs> we don't have enough lots. So, crop these. You saw it late? Yeah, sure. You play every winter since university. That map has been around since like 2016. Oh, wow. You love Minecraft? I have never played it. I've seen other people play it. But... Am I going to use this Mace Plus 4? Probably if I have to fight something where this sword won't hurt him. Let me look about potions. Po uh, let's see. Potion of healing. Gosh, that still could be useful. I'm going to hang on to that one. Get rid of this. Potion of speed. Get rid of The ring mail, I don't need to pick up. See a copper key. Perfect. So that's one of the keys. I think we need like four keys or something ridiculous. We'll go back to town and identify. See what we got. Cody says it's great if you love Lego but don't have Lego money. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I never had Legos when I was a kid. Too expensive. Long sword plus one, really? <laughs> Regular shield. We already knew that was true. Regular Elven chain cell. Regular spear. Regular ring. <laughs> what the? This is garbage. Uh, well, plus four, so, yeah, that was all junk. So, the mace plus four, we'll keep that, sell this. Cody says, is Azure Bonds a story prequel to, to pool games or do you transfer for adventure's sake? Yeah, it is. Um, it goes Pool of Radiance. That's the first one. The second is Curse of the Azure Bonds. The third is Secret of the Silver Blades. 
and then the fourth which is the one i'm in now is pools of darkness that's the last one that we can transfer our characters in Good. That looks good. All right, so we did the green cave. off on fire touch. Caustic vapors. Lotirith is just coming through the archway with his followers. You hear a boasting about how the challenges will ensure the next Dracolich will be the most powerful ever created. Stopping short as he sees you, he orders his followers to attack. Well, he retreats. Okay, a bunch of mages. One group of mages. Cody says, oh wow, I thought the pool, pool's games were of their own. Uh, yeah, th you would think that because there's two of them that have the word pool in it and then the other two don't. Yeah, it is weird. Yeah, there's basically, out of the fantasy series, there's three. There's the Forgotten Realms Pools and there's the Forgotten Realms uh, Savage Frontier, which there's only two of those. And then there's the Kryn, Champions of Kryn, Dark Queen of Kryn. That takes place in the Dragonlance world. Um, so those are the three major ones. And then, of course, you have Buck Rogers. There's two of those. Those are considered gold box. Delayed blast fire of all time. Ride mages. That's a lot of experience, okay. Let's detect magic here. Ooh, okay. It may be time to switch bow from banded mail. We're gonna check this out. Minus five. Minus one. Let's do that's a plus one so those aren't the best bracers bring a protection plus two will give us minus three and then we can actually equip a cloak so and then we'll match the band of mail plus five so let's give the ring protection plus two if I can find it I think I sold it. There it is. Okay. 
Now he needs a cloak. I have that cloak of protection plus three somewhere, I think. Oh, he's wearing it. Okay, that's right. I gave the cloak of displacement to the mage. Let's give that back to Bo. Minus five, there we go. So now he has bracers on and if I find a better ring of protection, he'll actually do better. None of that we need. Oh, there's a ton of darts. Nice. Perfect. Cody says, I'm way less familiar with gold box games than others. I only really dabbled in them. Yeah, I'm kind of the opposite. <laughs> Oh, dragons. And they're close. Really need to get repositioned here. Cast a spell. I'm glad um, he did that and didn't breathe. So this is the one. Oh, there's a whole bunch over here. Oh boy. Let's hope the mage goes first. Somehow it ended my turn. I think I accidentally hit E. Oh, the mage got interrupted. This is not good. We got to get you out of here. Okay. Do a delay. Stinking cloud. back for a second. I'm going to position you right here. You're going to do monster summoning. Okay, now you get to go. Perfect. Lay Blast Fireball. Keeping you out of the way. These fights are very dangerous. Cody says Buck Rogers looks cool. I think that might be the only ones I don't have on COG. It is. There's only two of them, but um, they're really hard. Because of the way healing works in that game. You can't really rest. It's, it's kind of weird. Yeah, Liquid Mouse Lines says Buck Riser is very difficult because there's a lot of skills you can choose but cannot use in the game. It's very confusing and irritating. That is true as well. We're going to lay on hands. So I'm going to make it back to town and then I'll be done for now, guys. Get Slater leveled up. Well, 
we'll see. His thing is probably still not going down. Minus three. Yeah, it's forever going to be stuck. Okay. We'll see if he gets another spell. Oh, he gets another fourth level. Wow, that's actually nice. Another Cure Serious. Sweet. All right, guys. Excellent progress today. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.